my house, crashed two houses away from Dan's house, and Dan slept through it. <laughs> yeah, well, that's not that's not surprising. Dan can sleep through anything. And the other <laughs> thing about Dan Conley is, you know what? You have to think in Dan Conley time because if you're going to say, hey, Dan, we're going to go out and I'll pick you up at 7, just basically <laughs> plan on 8.30. You know, I mean, it wasn't unusual for me to drive up Lonsdale Street, nope. beat the horn in front of Dan's house because we're going to go up the park, grab some beers, hang out. And Dan's got his guitar on, wearing a towel on the front porch, giving me, giving me the one minute signal, which means, all right, I think I have time to go get a pizza, come back. And oh my then God. Him. So, yeah, it's, you know, the things that, you know, were kind of just, you know, what you would consider norm out there, it's different, you know, I mean. I don't see anyone living life that way anymore. And, you know, it's totally different, but you know, the thing is, you know what, Dan's my bud. And this is like, we talked about loyalty and being friends. It's like, you know, and I'll wait for him. I'll put up with the shit, you know, and we put up with a lot of shit. People put up with my shit. You know, I mean, cool. I remember one night being up the park and we're hanging out, drinking uh, by the basketball courts, lights goes out. We move over towards the stairs. We get a little barrel fire going four or five cruisers come in and next thing you know there's a couple of bikers bikey cops coming through the park and flashlights everywhere me being very agile and ninja like <laughs> i ended up escaping the cops and run up the stairs which if i ever tried doing now i'd probably have a heart attack right me too. and i get to the top and there's two cruisers up there and one of the doors is closed, but all I can see is a pair of Converse trying to smash out the back window. <laughs> and that's the first time I actually, I think, met Mark Doherty. <laughs> he was the one in there trying to smash his way out of the car. And I'm like, oh, my God, what, what, what's going on here? You know, so I, so many stories, Chris. I mean, like it, it's something where 